please watch my direct TV news breaks. Here are the highlights of some news making the rounds today. I am Lola Bay. A recent report has revealed that the federal government's revenue stood at 922.08 billion naira in April 2014. The amount surpassed the receipts in preceding month and corresponding period of 2013 by 5.3 and 17.2% respectively. Shareholders of Union Bank of Nigeria PLC yesterday approved the request of directors to raise about $750 million capital. The directors have asked the shareholders, among other things, for the authority to take all necessary steps to raise medium term funding by the issuance of debt instruments and tenor bonds. We hear that the federal government may have received a total of 4.2 trillion naira in five years, with a total bid of 17 billion naira every month for at least five years, amounting to 840 billion naira a year. United Kingdom's flag carrier British Airways yesterday said it will soon acquire 72 aircraft to boost its operation in Nigeria and other parts of the world. The World Bank Board of Executive Directors has approved $200 million credit to improve Boyer State's disaster risk management capabilities, strengthen community-based resilience capacity, and provide support for risk assessment and early warning systems in the bottom of the state capital. And on sports, Guinness Nigeria PLC official bureau response of the Nigerian Super Eagles in a continued effort to boost their morale at the ongoing 2014 World Cup has increased the reward per goal from $2,000 to $5,000. For details on this news brief, please visit www.bizwatchnigeria.ng. You can also follow us on Twitter at BizwatchNigeria and like our fan page on facebook.com forward slash BizwatchNigeria. That'll be all for now, but remember, there's nothing so useless as doing efficiently that we should not be done at all. These are the words of Peter Drucker.